Basic perspective. This is one of the most important skills that car designers or designers of any manufactured object need to learn. Now starting with a horizon line, we're going to draw a cube. A cube is basically a three-dimensional square, equal sides. We're going to put two vanishing points on either end of this horizon line. We're going to start to draw our cube, extending the edges of that cube all the way to the vanishing points. The vanishing points represent where parallel lines disappear at the horizon. And so we're just going to keep connecting all the sides of the cube to those vanishing points. That's a basic perspective cube. Now, we may not always draw horizon lines and vanishing points, so even when we're drawing cubes in different perspectives, we may not have the room on the page to extend them all the way out to a vanishing point within the page. So we may be extending out to vanishing points that are off the page. It also depends on the focal length of the viewing angle that we're trying to get. If it's a more distant view, the vanishing points get further apart and the line's more parallel. So your assignment is to learn basic perspective by drawing lots of cubes in different views, different perspectives. Try drawing them from a bird's eye view, from more of an eye level, maybe from underneath. From one side or another. Favoring one face and foreshortening another. And then from there, we can start to play around with the proportions of that cube. Perhaps it's not a cube at all. Maybe it's more of a rectangular shape. So again, drawing our horizon line and vanishing points, we're gonna draw a flatter, longer, wider object. So this one's gonna have a defined length and width and height, something more similar to a vehicle in terms of proportions. It's very important to draw through the form as well. It really helps to set up your understanding of what's going on within the object. So I'm not just drawing the part you see, I'm drawing the part inside as well. And then once again, we're gonna practice drawing this elongated rectangular shape. And you can see once again, the vanishing points may go off the page. It's good to extend those vanishing points as far as you can. You might try drawing one which is favoring the frontal view and foreshortening the sides. Maybe draw it for more of a bird's eye view. and more of a frontal view again. So your assignment is to practice drawing cubes and rectangular shapes in many different perspectives, many different points of view. This is one of the most essential skills for car designers. So learn it well.